If you guys are looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now, make sure to check out my brand new sponsor, MMO EXP. They have the cheapest coins that you can find anywhere in the internet. Use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. What's going on everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to go over the market and its crash from all these fan appreciation packs, guys. The new Ultimate Legends, the fan, appreci fan appreciation packs, and just literally everything that's come out this week as far as pulls, the first fan appreciations, fan appreciation twos. Guys, overall... There's been a massive, massive market crash. Like, unbelievable. It's crazy, guys. You don't even understand. I don't know if you guys have been following it. For anyone who just kind of, like, casually plays Madden and just goes into game plays and check the market, if you if there's ever time to upgrade your team, it'd probably, it, it'd probably be now. I'm telling you guys, this would be the best time to upgrade your team. Things are super cheap. For all you guys who are watching my, my yesterday's video, if you saw at some point, I did see Simeon Rice for, like, 45 to 50K. Now, I found out later that was a snipe. But he actually does go for, like, 85K, which is a 99 overall card. For 85k that's pretty unbelievable like look at this 98 overall card 62k a few 99s right up here for under 100k as of yesterday at least are they back up so things might be back up a little bit guys but nothing is up about ultimate legends being that cheap now here's the thing what if we get fan appreciation three packs currently we have twos twos are fine if we just get if we get more twos if we get just more twos released into packs and we can, we're able to open up more of those when that day comes buy your players now if we don't get more twos we get threes which are even better guys that could be the very end of this market but let's see so yeah simian rice now is 110k which is still super cheap the fact you can get a 99 overall end game card for that price now simian rice great honestly i don't think he's amazing he's fast he has good finesse but his block shit isn't too great i don't think he's amazing but that's still a 99 overall player at the end of the day no matter how you look at it michael vick is 170k so i did lose money on him wow that is cheap for michael vick i think a lot of other guys would be a lot cheaper that's super cheap for michael vick but overall guys before we get into the rest of this video make sure you're down below hit that subscribe button turn that notify bell boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up down and go down below in the comments and let me know what you guys have been buying are you guys buying what are you guys doing now guys make sure to also if you need any coins right now remember we do have rookie premieres coming up probably in like june we do have a lot of cheap cards if you guys need coins Go check out my new sponsor, MMO EXP. They do have the cheapest coins on the internet. Go check them out. Use code Poodle. Go pick up some coins, guys. You can get like a million coins for pretty cheap. A lot cheaper than a bundle, I'll tell you that. But moving on. So guys, here's my here's my opinion. What I would do is I wouldn't buy cards just yet. I think I'd wait till this Friday when we won well, either A, Thursday we got golden tickets, and this Friday if we get more fan appreciations. So either A, we get more fan appreciation twos and the market crashes, like I said, or we get fan appreciation threes somehow, which is a brand new version of them, and the market actually dies. Those card, those that, those pack odds would be ridiculous. I'd wait one more week, and then at that point, that's when Vic would be like 99k, 120k. That could be the actual end of the market. Look at this, a new Gronk's already in the low mid 300s, probably if you really filtered this out. Lawrence Taylor cheap, Randy Moss is cheap. Everything here overall is already cheap. I'm telling you guys, I'd recommend you just wait a little bit until the new ones come out now again could you buy now no one's stopping you from buying a 60 over a 60k 98 overall legend a 61k 98 overall jim brown trust me by all means go ahead and buy these cards they're probably the best cards you can get for that price like that that's crazy now remember those cards are like 67k for cunningham if we get fan appreciation threes cunningham's probably looking at 35 40k trading will be at an all-time low the market will be absolutely shattered vic 161k i'm telling you guys you can buy now. No one's stopping you. If you want to go buy, pick up coins and pick up some cards, by all means, go ahead. But next Friday, when we get more packs, hopefully, because I think they do replenish them every Friday or at least for at least another week or so. They haven't announced the end of it, at least or yet, that we know of. But things could get pretty crazy. I'm super sad. I haven't done a market video in a while, but this just seems so warranted. This has been beyond. This has been ridiculous. These prices are like, every time you think the market can't get worse, it pretty, it pretty much does. Jerry Rice, super cheap now. These cards will retain some value only because they are really great, like Randy Moss. Even Gronk's retaining some value, that's because he's brand new. By next week, Gronk probably like 250, depending. And Dwight Freeney was ass yesterday, so I mean, I'm not even gonna check him, but I doubt he goes for too much. Although we will check, because he is an LTD. Was he right outside? I believe he was. Nope, left outside, okay, no. He was actually an end, right? He was a right end. There we go. Okay, Dwight Freeney, 320K for an LTD. That's all you gotta know, first off, how bad he is. Second, how bad the market is. It's just a, it's a combined mix right now. I, I personally didn't like the white Freeney. Wow, things are you guys. You could build such a solid team. Like if you had a million coins right now, which honestly isn't that much to be honest with you guys. Like just by playing the game, if you had a million coins. You could easily pick up like 10 to 15, 90, like 90 overalls. If you pick them up for like 60k, you could pick up close to like 10 to 15, depending if they're 60 to 100k. Easy. 
all 99 you could probably make a you could probably pick up like seven of those for the pretty guy pretty pretty jack squad i just hope you guys don't have a, a held team right now had you guys had a team going through that crash you probably lost a lot of market value now let's go check out the ultimate legends i mean the i'm sorry the golden tickets because those are definitely interesting to see right now i know a lot of those are super cheap especially keith bullock that guy was cheap 262,000 for keith bullock he actually might be my new left outside linebacker he might come in his left outside as his own guy 262,000 okay and you know what's funny the developer who made this literally said guys don't don't talk crap about my golden ticket he's a lot better than the card shows trust me he knew he knew people were gonna hate it that's funny cam newton's 582 wow golden tickets were such a hot commodity for like for like six weeks straight they were too expensive Jay, okay, Jalen Ramsey's a pickup. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, if you have to pick up anyone, it's Jalen Ramsey. 99 overall cornerback, he's the GOAT. He's amazing. I'd recommend pick up Ramsey. Brian Burns is amazing as well, guys. If you don't wanna pick up uh, Keith Bullock, Brian Burns is an awesome edge rusher. Wow. Okay, so who I want, I definitely want, ooh, Vic is 1.2. And how much is Lamar? Lamar's 1.7. Okay, I'm about to start. I'm gonna go on a spending spree of golden tickets pretty soon. I'm gonna sell some stuff that I got. I'm going to go on a spending spree. I'm going to get Lamar as my free one, probably. Okay, okay. Let's plan this out here. Things are so cheap right now. I'm going to get Lamar as my free one. I'm going to buy Julio Jones as my number one wide receiver. I'm going to pick up Jalen Ramsey. And I'm going to probably get Brian Burns or... Yeah, no, I'm probably going to get Brian Burns. That's probably the move. Or if I just get Ramsey, Mike Evans, and, and Nitrain Lane. That's just, two, that's just three big cornerbacks right there that can all hit. That'd be fun. That'd be fun too. Or even, oh, I can get Bo. How much is Bo? No, no, no. I gotta get Bo. I gotta get, I'm gonna get Lamar, Bo, Julio. That's the moves. Guys, I'm excited for all this. They're super cheap. Like now they're affordable. Like I don't, I mean, 3 million is still a lot for all those cards, but I could spend 3 million on three cards or four cards. That makes sense to me. But 3 million for not even one card. Like Lamar used to be 4 million. It, it would've cost me 4 million for one card. Maybe. And if I want to sell it in reduction, I lose like half a million coins. Like 400k, but close to half a million coins. That is absolutely ridiculous. I could not even fathom the idea of trying to do that. It just, it, it didn't seem right to me, but now, Keith Bull, okay, that's, that's a snack. Not gonna lie. That's a snack, especially for a golden ticket that doesn't have to be powered up, is ready to go. Definitely a snack. I just don't know where I'd use him because, of course, all year I wanted his own linebacker. Now I've developed a new scheme where I don't actually need that zone linebacker the way I played off uh, defense now. So now I don't really need it. And of course, now is the time when. They, they drop one next and he's cheap too it's like it's just a joke in my face except he's not a left outside linebacker he's a right so still technically never got that outside linebacker at the left position that i've been wanting but i will take it zach entry again a really cheap one not bad either honestly guys like all i mean it's a golden ticket they're all good but by all means enjoy yourself start buying golden tickets soon once they, they're gonna keep going down as the weeks go on though so if you guys really want a good golden ticket type press like i said next friday if they drop for ages oh sorry fan appreciation threes i need one to know like vic will easily be like 800k a lot, a lot of these cards would be close to Keith Bullock range, which is crazy because they don't really, they're really hard to pull. So I don't know who's deciding these prices or you know what it is. It has to be like demand. It has to be that like people aren't really pulling them, but when they put up Bullock for 800K, no one's buying it. And then slowly you get to a price where people actually buy it at. So I guess people really just don't want them. People are really deciding these prices are technically because there's not a lot of them. So you'd think that the prices would be too cheap. Even like Vic, Vic's cheap, but I actually think Lamar Jackson is better than Vic. And that's just my personal opinion. So for me, I'm probably sticking with Lamar overall as my top guy who i'm going to take from the solos and then if i had to take a second it probably have to be vic obviously because quarterbacks and then Bo and julio are right there uh jalen ramsey's phenomenal guys i think that pretty much all the players really care about there's not much else to look at but don't one thing i have to say don't spend all your coins just yet do save coins for rookie premieres remember rookie premieres are the only things that allow you to use this year's stuff that you work so hard for to transfer to next year otherwise you're just gonna die with it you know this year's gonna die off and you're gonna have just that team dead on this madden i personally think at least save some coins for the rookie premieres pick like two or three guys let's say let's say one rookie premiere is joe burrow and you really love joe burrow or it's tua or it's deandre swift although he's a second rounder i don't know if they'll do him or if it's uh i mean it's very hard jeff okuda and you like those guys save it so you can get a chance to get them well you will get them but you get a chance to get them upgraded pretty early on they usually do some kind of like rookie upgrade in the beginning like they did with saquon so there's some potential there but guys it's about it for the video Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you are new to the channel, make sure you go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that on your boys. Come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up as always. And if you haven't already, guys, make sure to comment down below. Let me know what you guys are doing with all your coins right now. Are you guys buying? Are you waiting? Do you think there'll be fan appreciation three packs? I don't know, but I think there's a decent chance of it. 
But guys, that's about it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Enjoy your Memorial Day. I will see you guys tomorrow, but that's about it. I'm out. Peace.